the ingredients that I'm going to use from the mandolin slicer are the potatoes, which I cut about four more small potatoes to go with this, the onions, the bell peppers, and the carrots. And I'm going to be cooking all this on my Blackstone E-Series indoor electric griddle. And if you're interested in any cooking on these, I actually have several videos that I've made cooking different stuff on it. So the first thing that I'm going to do is put some butter on here. And if you're wondering why the griddle already looks kind of dirty, it's because I just used it right before this video to cook my wife some chicken and shrimp before she came home from work. So first I'll put my potatoes down. These moved around just a little bit. And I'm going to go with some sea salt. And fresh ground black pepper. Next, I'll throw my carrots on. My bell peppers and my onions. I do have the griddle set to 400 degrees, but I think I'm going to kick that up to about 450. And I'll get all this stuff mixed up pretty good. Now, this is actually the larger size griddle. I have a 17 inch also. And I'm really still using both sizes, but for this amount of food, it really fits so much better with the 22 inch. Okay, I've got everything mixed up a little better, so I'm going to close the hood, and I'm going to come back about every three or four minutes and turn everything over to be sure that everything is cooked. Okay, it's been about four minutes. Let's check everything and see how it's coming along. It's coming along pretty good, but it's got a little ways to go. You can see right here that the griddle has cooled down a fair amount because this is really a lot of food. So again, I'm just going to flip everything up and turn it, make sure it's all cooking fairly evenly. And then I'll end up closing the hood for probably another five minutes or so. All right, let's give it a few more minutes. Okay, it's been about 18 minutes since I first put my onions, peppers, potatoes, and carrots on the griddle. And I have tossed it a few times that I didn't show on camera. In hindsight, I probably should have went and set the griddle for about 500 degrees. But this is the first time that I've cooked this amount of food on this particular griddle. So next time, I'll definitely go with 500 degrees. I did check one of the potatoes, and they are ready to go. So let me pull this off of here, and we'll have a look at them. So I hope you enjoyed everything. I hope you enjoyed the review of the Prep Solutions Mandolin Slicer. I hope you enjoyed this little bonus Blackstone E-Series cook. And if you did, please give the video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. As always, I appreciate you watching and I'll see you in the next video.